All right. So here we will see how we are going to run our application on all the three platforms, Windows, Android, and iPhone. Okay. So um, let me select this Windows project as a startup project. Make sure you have selected this ARM here because I am going to connect my Lumia phone and uh, generally Lumia phones are having ARM type of processors and uh, from here select device and just select on click on this device. So let me connect my phone. Let me connect. Let me project my phone using an app. So this is the app through which uh, project my screen is the app through which I am projecting my Lumia phone to the desktop so that you guys can see it. And here you can see the XAML that we wrote having just a single label in our page is this is how it is going to be displayed on our phone. Okay. So you can see this is how it is going to be deployed on our Windows phone project. Okay, so let me now run the same application on our Windows desktop application, Windows desktop operating system, right? Why? Because this application is of type UWP, Universal Windows Platform. So any application which is of type UWP can be run on Windows Phone and Windows Desktop, both, if they are of type Windows 10, right? So from here, my Windows machine is of type 64 bit processor and I'm going to run this app on my local machine, right? Let me click it. And now my app is going to be launched. And first, if I show you it in the start menu, you can see it uh, in Hey, here you can see hello to xamarin.uwp app is installed here, right? So we can click it and we can launch it. So you can see this is a complete Windows desktop application. Have you wrote any Windows specific code? No. Have you wrote any Windows phone specific code? No. Neither you, wrote, you are going to write any Android or iOS specific code in almost in all general situations unless there is a very specific situation. So that is the beauty of Xamarin forms that without writing any platform specific code, you can run your application on lot of different platforms.